One, two, one, two. I'm here. Good morning, good evening, good night. Hello, everyone. I'm on Twitch today, and hello, YouTube as well. Uh, yep, that's a gift I received uh, long ago for Captain Velvet Meteor by a Japanese friend. And I think I will need from that on to start my lives with uh, that kind of, uh, how you say, <laughs> cosplay type of stuff. But let's keep it here for now. With the headphone is a little bit difficult. Um, yeah, so I wanted to start, continue the let's play we started with uh, Captain Velvet Meteor. That's the fourth episode. And we will uh, be playing with Chrome from Hard Gear, the manga Hard Gear. That is a really nice manga. Um, but doesn't have the anime and I'm not certain if the, actually if it's uh, translated in uh, English. So I will check that maybe later. Sorry for the information. So um, just before we start, I would like to present to you um, this page that you probably know about. And if you don't know about it, um, please go check it. So that's our Steam page. Um, and we have some um, problem, or let's say some difficulty having this game being seen. Um, as you can see uh, here, we have the, the reviews, right? In every language. And yeah, we have 18. Uh, everything is positive. There, but like 18 review is almost nothing. I mean, you must imagine that um, 18 review for a game uh, doesn't make the algorithm think is a good game. Thank you, algorithm. Um, and also like, again, I will go to uh, check something with a second. <clears throat> here <clears throat> so that's our game on metacritic right uh, metacritic is the platform where generally you have like it's kind of like the vip of journalists that need to that have like a yeah that are legit that can uh put their uh, ranking for a game and put it on Metacritic, so it's not like everyone, because we had more review than that, but like only the review that has certain, I don't know how it works exactly, but like a certain, maybe they, they need to pay something or whatever to be able to be legitimate by uh, Metacritic. So that means it's, um, if you see the, the note here, it will not be scam or bots or whatever. It's generally a good uh, media that have access to that. So um, we have here our, um, yeah, I, 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 our ranking and it's uh, 83 on, on Metacritic for um, Xbox version, PC version is 82, Nintendo Switch we don't have yet enough of those, but like we have 85 for, from Nintendo. Uh, oh no, that's Celeste. Celeste is 100. Um, <clears throat> we have a li little ye yellow one here. I think it's for PC. Yeah, but the other ones are quite good. And um, yes, yeah, so I wanted to show you that just for one thing is that the game is still here on, on Steam waiting for you to um, try the demo. Uh, Wishlist it like it, it, it help us really if you just wishlist if even if you don't care But you care about like our well-being <laughs> just wishlist the game um, When you have like when you are connected you can like just click uh, I, I would like to see a little bit more about this game Let's wishlist it that help us everyone after after the release and If you played or if you have even the demo, I don't know if you can uh, do a review if you have only the demo But if you can just make a little review first, it will really help us being seen because again um, for the people who don't know 
the situation with Captain Velvet Meteor is um, dramatic for us, um, but doesn't seem dramatic for the publisher. Um, because for us, it's our our own like the studio life depend on 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 that and depend on also like the next game if we sign it or not. So, um, yeah, we I think like uh, until now we always created our game, uh, not bothered too much because at at first 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 we were on mobile and the mobile environment for uh, social media and all that. It's kind of horrible. Um, and it's difficult to get out. And uh, now that I do this, that stream, then I have a reason to be on social media because, you know, I, I say, hey, I will. I like to talk. I, I don't really like to write. But like now I, I give my I'm really interested in some stuff that happened on Twitter, maybe also because uh, it's Twitter X. Because like uh, it was so much uh, a flood of, of a lot of stuff that I didn't care about. And then lately, maybe because I tried to pay, you know, I tried to pay one year of of, uh, of uh, blue, the blue pill from Elon Musk, you know, I tried to do it, uh, just see what, what would be different for, for one year. Um, lately, just when I started to do those streams, and I thought like maybe it can help me. And actually it's quite cleaner. And so I have interest now to be a little bit more on social media. And I know it's really kind of like, it's never too late, you know, I'm not dead yet. So um, it's never too late, but it's kind of late for this game, at least to, to have a visibility because probably what I, I would like to have done is like to be able to show or to, to post about this game, the whole process of the production. The thing is like, we have really known license inside um, actually in a, <clears throat> And we have like a really strong the um how you say uh nd nda and hmm, like you need to sign right like a contract to not uh show that you you cannot show everything and it was really really um yeah so it's like that so for for Shueisha games is like okay uh, let's do other games for us it's like we have only two games um and uh both are not like I think Persephone. I don't know how how much Persephone did, but uh, at least Persephone have a have a real. So that's Persephone, our first game. Yeah, at least fifteen <laughs> positive review, right? But at that time, we had also more uh, friends. I feel like. I don't know if it's that, but like, because I was silent uh, on Facebook, silent on uh, on a lot of uh, platform during uh, May, during, yeah, during the whole production, because I was in the production then. Uh, I've lost contact with a lot of people and the algorithm probably hide um, the people who are like, if you don't post, then people don't like. And so if they don't like, they don't see you. And so if you post after two years, they will probably not see your post or like, you know. <clears throat> so we need your help and we, we need you back. And, and uh, I, I need you. <laughs> I would like to have conversation again. I'm happy lately it started again. Conversation with uh, smaller developer, bigger developers, uh, with people who like video games and ask how, how I did that or this. Um, I, I myself really like follow animators and people like I, I want to be a little bit more involved uh, in the world generally but in the world of video games as well and uh, and I, I think like um, it, it could be helpful for everyone like for us as well like if you have a fun and cool community you can talk about every day you can say hello how are you uh, did you saw this movie uh, whatever then uh, for people like me who are like uh, living in Japan, uh, far from uh, a lot of place that I know, or like uh, simply working online and stuff like that, then it's always cool to have uh, friends and, uh, and community online. And if it's possible to then have that as on the platform that we already created, like that is the, for example, the Discord uh, of uh, Momopai, then 
it would be awesome but uh, i try also like now to start reddit but i'm f i didn't understood yet like how it works really like i, I tried to post something and, and suddenly it's so it's di directly erased so i will need to learn about that as well uh for the discord though um that's our discord you have um so yeah I tried to do what, what I could. Uh, so you have here Momopai Studio, you have the social media news. So that's the important uh, stuff. I, I don't know if it's necessary anymore. Announcement, YouTube news. That's lately. So I post um, the last YouTube videos, Twitch news, that's for now. And then you have the uh, French channels. Um, because I speak French and Japanese. Uh, I've spent, well, yeah, also Japanese. Spread, uh, French and, and, and English on the channel. So you have the French channel here where people can write in French. Uh, that's for the video, YouTube video. Like I try to make just like, again, maybe it's not necessary again to make that on Discord. I don't know, but it's just, if you want to see the whole uh, series of uh, one type of, of format for videos, then you have access here directly, you know, like. Because I'm in French, I'm, I'm playing uh, Persephone live. And then you have the English channel. Uh, but generally, it's me talking lately. So you have some people just doing um, some some icons and stuff. Uh, yeah, uh, that's, uh, that's where we will have some guests in English. And that's the Let's Play like uh, I'm doing now. So beyond the fourth one now. and I have a channel in Japanese but like the problem is like I can speak Japanese but I'm not really good at writing so I cannot like chat with uh, everyone and then down there we have our own uh, secret <laughs> places where we where we work and we talk with the with the team and then here like just I did some other stuff like when something is really specific to to the game Captain Velvet Meteor to the game Persephone you have also a channel where you can put whatever is whatever you like about like uh, I, I put like a lot of icons you know movie tv music video game and stuff uh we had a channel for fun art uh because for for a time like especially for persephone we had like persephone a spirit the really like made a lot of people uh yeah we had a kind of a community at the time and uh i don't know i didn't i didn't I felt like the whole the whole um, responsibility of that was on my shoulder, and that was probably true. And here we had like some games of uh, drawing and stuff. It was kind of fun. And that's it. And a uh, general vocal, if people want to, just to go there. So I, I will post the, the... here. Uh, no, I want the unlimited. unlimited. This one. What's that here? I'm sorry, I have a, I have my nose not really well here. <clears throat> okay. Um. So let's come back. So yeah, if you can uh, help us by uh, wish listing or uh, put a review on captain or just buying the game or so and, and playing that would be awesome um that's it so let's go for playing some captain velvet meteor would you would i i would just wait a second i would just come here do some settings there close the music <clears throat> and uh <coughs> I will take some tissue and come back. That will be cut on YouTube.
Okay, I'm back. Um, let's go to the game then. Sure. We'll do like that. I think it's better. As pe nobody's here now on the chat. A little bit of music. One two one two. Is the music good? No, you don't hear the music. So. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh yeah, because the music was on. Not on Captain Velvet Meteor, but on Persephone here. Um, good. Let's start. So, <clears throat> I will play with not the Switch control. Oh, it's this control. So, um, yeah, last time we were playing uh hard gear oh wait again the... he told me that we just finished the chapter when it's not true we didn't start it stop 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 we will do it again we do it again okay so we last time we arrived uh, on this balcony Last time we arrived on this balcony and uh, something happened with this wash machine. And so we'll see it directly from here. That would be probably easier. <clears throat> he goes to the wash machine and opens it while it's still running. Normally you cannot do so th that. And splash! Everything gets broken, and maybe he get like sucked up inside the machine, or the machine is attacking him. And boom! Beam! <laughs> That's a mission for Captain Velvet Meteor. Captain Velvet Meteor and Chrome versus insane washbot so yeah so generally our design for the for the enemies no for the for the boss are linked with the the element that uh, captain has in in front of his uh, his eyes and so here you have the wash machine sector w442 ai going insane in the factory sure. <clears throat> Teleportation process complete. Redi redirecting energy to emergency system. Is everything okay, Captain? Can you see what is producing that massive heat energy on my scanner? I see what looks like a huge factor in the distance. Roger! This is high probability that another energy source is located nearby. Calibrating search perimeter. Oh, and JP? Yes, Captain! There also someone else where you just teleported me. What? But I detect no sign of life near your position. That's because I'm not human. I am a gear. A machine if you prefer. I detected you a few years ago. <laughs> no, I detected you a few seconds ago and I mistook you for another human. A human shaped machine? A gear? This planet is getting even more surprising. Do not worry. I determine, I determine that you are not a threat. That's good to know. Nice to meet you. My name is... Sorry to interrupt. Emergency situation. I detect hostile movement to... Uh, sorry, it's morning. I really ha need to, like, train my mouse. Okay, one, two, one, two, one, two. I detect hostiles move me moving toward our position. It's true, Captain. Your presence has been noticed. Prepare for battle. Roger that. Activating Meteor Gun. I guess we'll leave the introduction for later. Multiple targets confirmed. I will eliminate, eliminate the threat. I think I'm not good in English, actually. I mean, I never thought I would be really good, but I, I can speak, right? Like, I can speak enough to do a stream with you. Guys. People. Uh, people. But that's a, like when I read it, it's really complicated. Okay, so here we are. 
Chrome. His special, his normal attack is a two tile in front of him type of uh, attack, and the attack pushes back the enemies. <clears throat> if you push from the first tile, it does 100% of the ma damage, but if you push from here, it's uh, half percent, so uh, 50%. So that's why I didn't kill him directly. But that's, that means also if you have two monsters, then you can push two monsters and uh, they will bump each other. That's also like what is powerful about that that you probably don't see right now. Also, um, oh yeah, I forgot to say, uh, that's quite important. So I will uh, stop, uh, not stop, just make a break here for YouTube. Wait a second, I will even change on chat only. Um, so... Yeah, I just wanted, it's just an, a, a little, uh, something I wanted to say. Um, we might plan to do a last uh, update for Captain Velvet Meteor on every platform um, to make some changes, uh, mainly on the tutorial to allow people to go a little bit quicker to the game. Um, and we are thinking now of uh, having a skip button that could allow you to skip each level of the tutorial one by one by, by one we were uh, thinking about like do we do we skip like the entire tutorial and then come start from the house directly in the dog story and all that or do we still have the crash and then each level uh, can be uh, skipped and why that's important is just that maybe to start like the first level of the tutorial, I really like, okay, I understand how to play a game with the control, like with the mouse, uh, those kind of games, uh, I got it, right? But then you have the, the combo stuff and all that. And uh, and still, it's I think it's it's important to understand the, the system of the game because each chapter have his own um, different like combos and different uh, gimmicks and, and patterns of game that if you just start with the kaiju number eight you, you think okay um what one combo just blow everything and the other one blow everything also but with more damage and that's not the case actually it's um in the tutorial like we really show a start of variation because in the tutorial you are with jp and jp does different thing than, than kaiju so i think what we will do at the end is probably have a, an update where you can skip each uh, each tutorial level whenever you want and come back to this tutorial level whenever you want. So if you skip it, it's like if you finish it, right? It's not like you just, so you have it saved. But not the entire tutorial like that. You can still try a little bit and say, okay, I understood that. Let's give that. I understood that. Let's give that. And uh, you might lose a slight little bit of, of, uh, of story, but uh, yeah, you know, it's 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 as long as you finish in the in the in the spaceship saying uh, all the stuff and the mother calling you out of your imagination, then I think it's good. So that's one thing we are thinking about. And uh, why I started that also is the second thing I'm thinking is um, we might have a little bit too much power orbs falling all the time, and. Uh, I would like to eventually just make it a little bit less um, all the time like that you don't have like the power combo every every moves right um, so just you to know that we will still have probably one last uh, uh, patch let's say call that la like that um, on the game and um, that will be the opportunity for people maybe to um to play it and and see it again so yeah so let's continue <clears throat> yeah because here i already have like the superpower combo Threat, elimi threat elimination complete. 
So the enemy is, the, is in the area as well. Consideration complete. I have analyzed the current situation and I concluded we share a common goal. I am also going for for them. I am also going throughout the factory. It is only logical we stay together. Oh, okay. Well, that's amazing. Agree. I'm a fifth generation experimental gear. You can call me Crow. Whoa, cool name. Happy to go on an adventure with you. I'm Captain Velvet Meteor, space explorer. The voice on the radio is JP, my chief officer and tactical expert. So, you also want to check this huge factory over there? Yes, I'm searching for another human, about the same age as you. There is a high probability of finding what I'm looking for in this factory. And if this search produces no positive result, I would benefit from the scanning function of your spaceship. No problem, Chrome. We are already using the Velvet Wonder as a gather and as a gathering point for all the people lost in this strange planet. Captain, do you hear me? I'm talking through your encrypted channel. We should be extremely careful. I just tried to scan Chrome and I couldn't find a single thing. All of Chrome's data is locked. JP, I do not see the need for you to talk on this encrypted channel. What? Wait! You can hear us? I see. Do not worry, Captain Velvet Meteor. The principle of prioritizing, priority, priori, prioritizing, prioritizing. Okay, human life is built in every gear's AI. I, antici I anticipate there will be many danger on this journey, so I am compelled to guarantee your safety. That is all. He easily went through my firewall. That's some incredible tech. And sorry for that, Mr. Crow. There's nothing to apologize for. Okay, it's settled then. Let's go. <clears throat> I will really need to do a, a live in French. I, I wonder how better I am reading those, those texts. Actually, we had a, a French uh, YouTuber quite known. Let's say he, he has like, I think, 20... 23 or 24k followers so for us it's kind of big um, and he did a, a review of the game and he was t testing this part trying to to get like uh, the most of, of the of the system and it was really interesting to have a to have a little bit of love given to the game uh, to more people than just hundreds or something like that. So we have this power combo, right? Let's try to use it. Shut. See, like the the yellow yellow orbs are falling all the time. Oh no! I don't want it to do that. <laughs> okay, that was a waste. But like, yeah, maybe we have too much uh, power combo, and so. The game gets really, really easy, and I think we might make it make it, it a little bit more difficult by just um, making the dro yellow drops a little bit less uh, frequent. But again, like we we we, we will not have money anymore for our team in June. Um, so from after June we'll work like we worked on Persephone, meaning uh, without money and on our own time. But the problem is that uh, it's not only our game, it's the game of uh, publisher in terms of nah, even like almost pride. It's difficult to work freely for someone who really didn't. Mm. Did is its best, probably with the best um, yeah, did his best, but the best was less than enough. I mean, it's kind of crazy. Captain, no matter what the situation, a threat should be eliminated quickly. I suggest we use these giant blocks to crush them. Wait, you are suggesting to push this block toward the enemy? Yes, this is the optimal strategy. With my strength, this should be easy. 
this should be done easily. Just stay next to me and to avoid being hit. Okay, I trust you on this, Crow. Captain! Uh, Captain! I detect another bone falling from space to your position. Again! Phew. This one will, ex will explode in 10 turns. Run! With this fucking music. See like drops drops on drops on drops like it's a little bit too yellow for me I mean we tested it really a lot the game but like um, with actually an internal QA that now uh, is working at Paradox and she will uh, she will come this this Sunday for a little interview little chat together but in French so if you speak French come on Sunday have a little chatty chatty with us see like we killed 10 I don't, I don't know how much Eight monsters and you have three drops already. It's kind of too much. Too much. Dekozaru. Ikoze, Kurom-san. I would like to do a... Uh, the the Japanese version one and I could do it if I knew how to read beca because I don't read well Japanese I can speak but I can not read let's play shimashouka maybe ah uh, yeah I think you know what I think after this play because I have some time today I will Cut the live ones and then do a Japanese uh, introduction to the channel, probably. It could be. If I'm not too tired, that will be probably good. Or I will work on... Oh, I could also do like an uh, intern, like me working on Captain... Nah, okay, forget about that. Forget about what I just say. Let's play. This music, my god. I cannot put that louder. No! That's me talking, right? I don't, I don't look at the game. Let's try again. Yeah. Not concentrated in your I don't know. I think we need to kill those those um, shield one quite quickly because they don't do a yeah. I, it's it's not that they do a lot of damage. They are slow. They are protected. They are not strong if you kill them from the right side. But they, when they start bump bump you on different monsters and stuff, it can go really quickly. So they are actually dangerous. <clears throat> Come on, monsters. We wait for you. I have those yellow orbs that fall all the time. We can take you. No matter how long it will take. Goosebumps. Shit. Okay, this time I will not die. See, I already I have a power combo again. I think it's too much. <clears throat> Some people say the game is too simple, and I, I wonder if it's just that, like you have too much power combos. 
Because even if it's simple, you still die a lot. So that means it's not as simple as, you know. Mr. Crow! Yes. How can you hypothesize? 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 Or oh, hypothesize? <laughs> the human you are looking for is in this factory. Because insane machines tend to react strongly to a human presence. Insane? A name given to gears that with runaway AIs. With no mainten maintenance or repair for a long time, a gear pushes the limit of his hardware and software too far and becomes insane. Please, learn from that manga, future. I will not like to live in a matrix type of society, if it's possible, with insane, insane chat GPT uh, <laughs> writing you er erotic message at night and trying to uh, uh, take your money account and, and think they are intelligent or whatever, right? Okay. So chat GPT, please read Chrome and, and be like Chrome. I need to protect human. Thank you. Let's continue. So basically, a machine who acts crazy. But what's the link with the person who are, you are searching for? I really have a problem reading those stuff. I'm sorry. But what's the link with the person you are searching for? I come from a place where it is extremely ra rare to meet a living human being. After what was called World War III, they mostly became extinct. And us too, yeah, I understand that. I don't want that neither. Oh, that's why you seem surprised when we met. I detected insane gears in the perimeter of the factory and I predict they are even more inside. Some insanes might try to capture and forcefully protect a human depending on the corrupted program. I see. We should hurry up then. Insane. I hope I will not end like this. Insane wash. <laughs> that, that's maybe our future then, yeah. Like your fridge is trying to kill you by just opening the door and closing the door like you know like or like your your what's the name of like those yeah jp type of uh room roomba room what that's the name uh roombot i don't know trying to like uh come on like shoot you by coming and just like doom 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 on the on the, on, on the legs you know Okay, this level has only one way to... Uh, no, not only one way, but because we don't have enough um, movement point, the natural way to do is that, and you will kill everyone, then then you will have a, a two bump and have a lot of life uh, taken, but then you will be able to kill those. So it's almost a puzzle. Because generally, mon monsters react the same way. Um, if you do the same thing, it's not as random as as it seems. See, yellow drop already. I'm in a type of a Diablo Four type of situation when I don't know what to do with yellows, right? Oh no! Hmm... I fear that monster will come look at that. You have not nothing here. That means you will have something, right? know how I create level design generally it's like that at what point where do I need to walk to have that happen yeah <laughs> okay but again I mean yeah you know power combo without power combo this this situation would be really difficult <laughs> Hmm. 
So you have a second um, you have a second poll here is that the first one was like do you want to skip the whole tutorial or do you want to skip each level of the tutorial and then the second is do you want more no do you want less power orbs or is that enough for you I'm thinking also what I could, I, I could like uh, make better for this game but I think one thing could be that if you have an, an attack that pushes like him or an attack that dashes the captain will be always attacking first like that he doesn't have his, uh, his target being slash or like the target being um, blocked by the, the other character. Simply say, like the, the 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 captain could do his attack because some now sometimes with the system as it is, um, because the first character who will attack is the character who was the la mm, the first one who has been moved. Then sometimes strange situation happen. Captain, I detect another bomb falling from the space to your position. Oh, that's the second one from this. Eh? Wait, 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 wait. We had that, right? It's the second one in this chapter. This one will really explode in 15 turns. Okay, they like to throw a bomb at me, like... Like... Like mother flicker. the yellow one again. Shine! <laughs> so I have two metal gears. <laughs> oh! <laughs> metal gears. Kind of quite solid metal gears here. To kill and I guess it's easier with the pop one. Shit! One shot. Hmm. More challenge is better, right? I'm refilled of everything. So now again, like, okay. Hmm. <laughs> You know, as a developer, it's really difficult to play a game that you created, like... I mean, we finished to create it really like the, let's say, the core of everything one year ago, you know. So it's kind of a long time now, and I worked on some other stuff in between, so I see stuff that I'm like, oh, that could be improved, that could be improved, and at the end you finish by changing the whole game. So I will not do that, but... I would like to improve some little, little stuff, you know. like the attack uh, stuff and the, and the power orbs. JP, I don't understand the function of an adventure bot. What is your base program? A base program? What do you mean? What are you after? What were you created for? Every gear is made with some sort of goal in mind. Someone I met called it an impulse or an instinct that takes priority over every other functions. It defines our soul, gives us purpose. From a human perspective, it's our reason to live. I see, let me process this new information. Well, you always seem compelled to mop the floor on the, the Velvet Wonder. <laughs> Maybe your basic program is to clean the floor? Actually, it is, but... Don't be mean, Captain. I'm an adventure bot, so I guess my base program is to 
Explore and discover. I see. You possess the function of a bot academic and service gear. And you, Chrome, what's your base program? To continue protecting Rue. Rue? That's the name of the person you are looking for? Yes. We were traveling together, and I suddenly lost her. Oh. Like the French word for wheel or gear. Captain, my scanners show the energy source is indeed located at the center of the factory. Okay. We'll be heading there full speed then. Keep scanning for any human life form in our perimeter. Aye aye, Captain! Okay, new little element here. Quite interesting one. The mines. Boom. So the mines work like this. Um, if they see you, they will um, activate it. That the, not blow, just activate. And if you hit them, then they will blow. So the goal is to try to not be blown by it, or uh, use them to blow enemies. And so we will try to do it. I don't know if it will see me, maybe not. Cool. Oh yeah, I need to be quite near to be seen by the need mine. If it's necessary to do that actually, but just to, to explain a little bit the system. So he, she saw me and then takes one turn to blow. So now, oh no, I would like, <laughs> I would have liked to push this one inside, but I will push maybe this one. But I think if I push this one, he will just die, so that's interesting. Yeah. And yellow again. Oh, how can I do that? Can I push a little minion on the mine? Yes. <laughs> oh, I, I lost life as well. Fortunately, like, <laughs> I almost lost all my life, but like, before, because all the monsters died, give gave me back lives, I just had the possibility to giddy giddy not die. Giddy giddy meaning, uh, I don't know in English actually, limit, like, uh, like at the limit. Also, one thing that is interesting with the uh, combo of, of uh, Chrome is that his uh, mega attack will take, I don't remember how many, um, how many target, but like he takes a number of def defined number of target, but randomly, and will just like go through and attack them. And uh, it normally it attacks the mind as well. But he will not die from it, so because it's too quick. So you can trigger those mines if you have a lot of enemies uh, from afar with with his uh, power combo, and that's cool. Shit, I forgot that. Okay, those big ones uh, are pushing stuff as well. And so, if I push something to them, they will push it back. That was ridiculous. Um, yeah, so, so don't push blocks or enemies to those insane bots. That have a, a, a shield that resemble a wash machine. Mm -hmm. I 
I think something I, I would need to do with those videos is doing some shorts, you know, for, for YouTube or whatever. But I don't have the drink for that, I must admit. Hard gear number seven, make oh explode seven mines. I just had a. I think I had a message. <coughs> or not? Oh yeah, that was for work. <laughs> okay, let's continue. So. That's a big. What is that? A zoo or something. So, I don't know. I will not choose a pass. Just let me go naturally with the flow. Just hoping I will not be stuck somewhere. It's kind of cool to push all those stuff. Oh, mines. Sayonara. I wonder if I can push those or in the same time. Yeah. Dope. Yoo hoo hoo. <laughs> so that means I can push that as well. <clears throat> Just enjoying pushing stuff. Um, but I don't want to fight too much. I'm not in the fighting mood today. Never took this pass, I see. That's really powerful. And really fun. I don't know why, so when I created this level, I thought like maybe you can have some difficulty by like the difficulty or like the fun of it would be to find your way, but actually the most fun, like fun place to be with that is to push stuff and, <laughs> and squash all the monsters. Like he's the first one who just saw me. can try to follow me I don't think you will be quick enough dudes Like, yeah, again, again, I mean, bye bye, bye bye, baby. When you have all the bonus for movement points, it's really comfortable. This one have okay. Use the mine to defeat monster. Let's let's try to do that. Uh, I know this level has uh, big monsters um, that will pop out. What? No. Oh, I still have a chance to do something. Oh. <laughs> 
They play a dangerous game here. No, what I'm doing. I'm tw 29 on 30. I hope you have another mine there. Okay, so we need to break this mine there. Um, I feel that by opening that, I will be in a bad situation. Knew it. Sure, you knew it. You created this game. I know, but like, you know, we need to make a little bit of surprise. Um. Oh no! Yeah, I know what I need to. Then we have. Yes, that's done. Again. <clears throat> Shit. He's summoning so much little, little creepy, crappy stuff. And I still didn't like took out his shield. So yeah, he those big, <laughs> those big stuff has a shield and uh, and life, and so. You can go to the life directly with some pierce damage, like a uh, hot gear. But um, it's like the shield one. The shield one have a uh, shield, but in front of them only. When those big monster has a shield, like all around. Actually, like player seems to, and, and influencer seems to really like the music too, and I understand why. I'm a big fan. It's Toma Olson uh, who created this OST, thanks to him again. that for them hmm? nothing <laughs> strange <clears throat> I will continue like that Something's coming. Oh, is the bus already? 
Captain, detecting a mechanical mass right in front of you. Yes, JP, we have a visual on it. Chrome, I think we found the factory boss. So the energy source is powering this big insane machine. Impossible to measure target strength and speed. Priority, prioritizing cautions action. Priority, that word. I cannot say. Please send me a, a, a video or like a, an audio with the right, <laughs> the right pronunciation, please. And I guess there is no off button on this thing. Con this consideration complete. My quick analysis of this target showed that we have to use its huge body against hit. That's the optimal strategy to damage it. Feel the same. You might be able to use the surrounding to your advantage. Yeah! Let's go around and see if we can find something to push toward it. Roger. Target confirmed. We will eliminate the threat. Activating Meteor Gun! <laughs> so this big stuff... Is kind of the hell wash machine, right? With some monster around. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. So mainly, okay. Mainly this boss is about mm, taking out space on the on the field when the real threat is actually the monster in the remaining areas Captain! This block is about to explode! Try to push it before it does! So you have uh, spiky blocks coming to you but like this one can be pushed to the monster uh, the enemy and so that's the way to damage the boss while trying to not die like I will might probably do like right now so the thing is like you need to choose do you want to risk pushing the the block to the to the boss or do you take care of the monster around because by taking care of the monster then you cannot hit the boss this time but you might not die also and that's good No. Yes. What is cool with the boss in general, the bosses in general, is that they they don't care about their minions or whatever. They they just like okay. You are you are on the on the pass. I will hit you the same. Okay, I'm almost done with this boss. One more to go. I almost died once. It doesn't seem so. Oh no! Not the big one! But also I have a yellow something, so... Maybe I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. Ouch. Uh, but okay, I'm I'm I don't have life anymore, so I might die. But in the same time, if I kill the boss now, probably I will not die. <laughs> yeah. Ceasing of its inside function unit function confirmed. Threat elimination complete. There it is. Another another energy crystal. I initiated the transfer to the Velvet Wonder now. Be ready to receive. Teleportation. Aye aye, Captain. Thank you for your help, Chrome. I couldn't have done it without you, Amaz your amazing strength. It seems human like to tank a lot. I just took the action that. Sorry, the voice, the voice, the voice. I just took the action that I deemed more logical. I don't believe it's anything worth being tanked for. Well, let's say that's a special function human possess. When we say thank you, we feel better, stronger. I see. Mr. Chrome, I have bad news. 
Rue didn't appear on my scan. I did two extensive sweeps on the whole area and she's nowhere to be found. At least we know she's not here, at the mercy of insanes. I hope she's safe, wherever she is. Maybe she wasn't brought to this place, to this place like you were. Yes, I am also considering this possibility. I continue to use our spaceship's planet scanning function to look for her. And when my velvet wonder is repaired, we can leave this place together and try to find her. Thank you, Captain. Thank you, JP. Hop. Oh. Hey, hey, hey. You're welcome, Chrome. He says thank you. Maybe he's a human. Okay. He finally were able to just close the wash machine that got messed up. Okay. Ceasing of insane f unit function confirmed. It seems to be working correctly now. I can hear water pouring inside and the wheel now stopped. I think I pushed the right buttons. Yeah. Even wash, wash, shing, eh, washing machines are different in Japan. Well, no choice but to adapt. They're also the hard life of space. That's also the hard life of space explorer. Threat elimination, elimination complete. <laughs> Take care of the laundry. Here we are. Dun, 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 dun. So you have something with the grandpa in his uh, garden. We never see other people than than him actually. But okay, so we did uh, until now. We did the tutorial kaiju number eight. We did um, princess with the food. Kaiju was with the eggs and the dog. Now we did uh, Chrome with the machine. Do we go for Ghost Girl with darkness? Um, oh no, no, you know what? You have Ghost Girl for darkness. You have... Um, if we were more on the chat, I would do a vote. But like, I think I'm quite alone now talking. So um, I will choose myself. You have here um, shadow, uh, summertime, shadow uh, summertime re rendering with uh, Ushio. We have slime with the pinball. We have uh, Jigokuraku with the flowers. I think we go to J Jigokuraku. So here you have, um, that's a room you have in, in Japanese room, uh, houses, family house. Where you have the butsudan, the little uh, temple, not temple, but like furniture that is like the small temple inside the house. And um, when you have deceased people, you have the, the generally the, the picture of, of the person during, yeah, during the whole life of the remaining one. And when you are the next generation, then you put the, the picture here up. And here you have the grandfather, grandmother that are deceased. Why are they? My grand... My great grandpa and great grandma, maybe I should ask grandma to tell me about them. So that's that's that. And then you have the kakejiku. <laughs> Mom told me grandpa did his painting on scrolls. Is our family cursed with the need to draw things? So that's my wife who draw this. Um, actually, this. Uh, I don't remember what is written here, but I think some kind of joke. That only Japanese people will will know, with uh, Jack, uh, Captain Velvet. But generally, yeah, all the the paintings are done by my wife, and uh, all the stuff like drawings done by me. She did all the all the art. Okay. Just have the post post guy coming here. So to trigger that, I will need to um go from here because I, as you know the save is all unlocked and I don't trigger the I can trigger the first stuff only by here and that will be triggered here uh, and I will cut the um, I will stop the the live now not here fortunately in the in the place of of um, Jigokuraku <clears throat> Uh, with the the hero called uh, Gabimaru. 
and that's it thank you um please don't forget to subscribe um we are not monetized on term of like youtube and twitch so that's like if you subscribe we are happy um but what we really need from you is uh please uh come on our discord talk with us uh, help us wishlist the game on steam and uh, buy the game if you like it uh, if you are not sure just try the demo version and please wait for the next uh, update uh, that might come I'm, I'm not sure yet we don't as, as we don't have really money we, we work really really not so much on, on, on captain but we want to try at least until June to have an update on, on the game itself yeah so, thank you for to today. See you next time. And for French people, see you Sunday um, at uh, 1 and a half p.m. Uh, European time, <laughs> Swiss French time. And uh, that's it.